Unlocking the Harmony, the world of harpsichord concertos. Hello, everyone, welcome to our English language learning journey through music. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of harpsichord concertos. Whether you're a music lover or just curious about this intriguing term, you're in the right place. Let's explore together what makes the harpsichord concerto a unique and captivating piece of musical history. Before we delve into concertos, let's understand what a harpsichord is. The harpsichord is a keyboard instrument, similar to a piano, but with a distinct sound. When keys are pressed, small quills inside the instrument pluck the strings, creating a bright and slightly metallic sound. This instrument was particularly popular during the Renaissance and Baroque periods of music history. Now, let's talk about what a concerto is. In the simplest terms, a concerto is a piece of music composed for an instrument soloist and an orchestra. It usually consists of three movements, where the soloist and the orchestra interact, taking turns to shine. The concerto highlights the technical skill and expressive abilities of the soloist, offering a dynamic and engaging musical experience. Combining the two, a harpsichord concerto is, therefore, a piece of music written for a harpsichord soloist accompanied by an orchestra. What makes harpsichord concertos special is their ability to showcase the harpsichord's unique sound in a rich orchestral setting. This genre flourished in the Baroque period, with composers like J.S. Bach leading the way. Bach's harpsichord concertos are celebrated for their complexity, beauty, and innovation, making them a cornerstone of the repertoire. You might wonder, why is this important? Studying harpsichord concertos not only gives us insight into a bygone era of music but also enriches our understanding of musical evolution and cultural history. For English language learners, this exploration offers a unique way to expand vocabulary, engage with complex sentence structures, and immerse in the cultural context surrounding a piece of history that continues to resonate today. Thank you for joining me on this musical voyage into the world of harpsichord concertos. I hope this exploration has piqued your interest and offered you a new lens through which to view the rich tapestry of music history. Remember, language learning is not just about words and grammar, it's about connecting with the diverse expressions of human creativity. Until next time, keep exploring, keep learning, and let the music play.